Good evening and welcome back to the Minecraft Obscurity Mod Pack. I'm Modia Parandis. We're back in our base here and I've expanded it a little bit between episodes here. I'll show off some of that. And we'll talk about some of the other things going on around here. And then uh, we'll go on a couple more quests and see if we can accomplish some more tasks in our quest book. So let's get going. All right, so as I mentioned, welcome back, first of all. And I managed to expand my base just ever so slightly. I'm trying to make it into a bigger circle than it was before. Actually, it wasn't even a circle before. It was kind of just an oblong ridiculous looking uh, thrown together thing now they have a little more security around here I'm trying to expand out the borders to make it a nice big circle here and they'll work on like expanding the farms out a little bit maybe uh, branching out into other areas um, having more rooms in this and also adding on a roof at some point so actually we'll be ultimately secure here once you have a roof on here we won't have to worry about things uh, dropping in on us we can move this interdiction torch someplace else and then we can uh, expand even further so that's the plan that's the that's the roadmap for right now but right now uh, I need more materials, I need to be a little bit safer, we need better weapons, we need better everything right now. Uh, last time we were worried about uh, collecting a, a villager uh, cube that we found, one of these compact machines, and uh, I did play it safe there before because I wasn't sure if it would lose the contents when we broke it or not, because I wasn't sure if it was upgraded or not. As you can see, this one is upgraded because it has the white ring around it, but as you can see on my little uh, my portable shrinking device here, it does say upgraded, yes. So uh, that's the uh, that's the that's the clue there. You just look at it with the thing, and it'll tell you if it's upgraded or not. And it turns out the one over there is not. So it's great that we didn't uh, break it because we would have lost the villager inside of it, and that would not be useful. So uh, what do we need to do today? We need to get some tin because our quest book still says we need tin. Uh, let's see, unearth the darkness is where we were at before we left off. We were no, not unearth the darkness, entering the darkness entering darkness and we were on the digging in the dark quest we need iron silver and gold we just got our pickaxe upgraded to obsidian level for mining though so we get obsidian now and we can also get uh one thing that we mentioned last episode or didn't mention last episode rather is that this had this tool has incorrect data so they did some upgrades to tinker's construct and iguana tweaks uh the episode before this and now they also did some for this episode too so we have to actually fix this again here now now it's got the correct thing the mining level is actually redstone now which I believe is even better than, actually, Obsidian is, uh, we should have kept it where it was, actually, Obsidian would have been better. Uh, Redstone is actually worse, I think. Um, so we gave ourselves a downgrade, but we're playing it the way it was intended. I did make a little bit of a hole here so I can get down to the mine quickly and easily, and that was one of the intentions with expanding the base around here. Uh, it is leveled with these slabs here, so it is safe up to a certain point here. But uh, right now we're vulnerable to everything, and we're going to put this back on just in case something bad happens. And we'll find our way back over to where our mine was. Oh, we're going to have this guy coming at us, though. Get out of here. Get out of here. We really need to find some... Oh, we just knocked him off the edge. Uh, we really need to find some... Uh, we really need to find some invars, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, my God, there he is. I was waiting for this guy to drip down on us. Uh, okay, we really need to find some invar, though. Oh, jeez. Wow, this is dangerous over here. Holy cow. All right. Leaving the house is a dangerous thing. Knock this guy into the void. There we go. <laughs> Goodbye, sir. Holy moly. All right. Uh, wow. Not a great start. <laughs> Down a lot of health already. Um, and uh, yeah, I think we're better off just maybe making a new mine. Actually, we did get pretty deep though before. Let's see if we can safely get over there. I think it's over here. Yeah, here we go. Right? No, this is not it, but this is going to be... Nope, not anything good here. Where is our hole from before? It's been a long time since I've been down here. There's some aluminum there. I don't think we're... I think we're good on that now though. Supposed to be aware of enemies dropping in on us. Let's see if we can figure out where our mine was before. Uh, this looks promising right down here, actually. So we can find a way to get. Oof, that nearly killed me. Uh, we can find a way to get down here quicker and easier next time. We don't need to worry about iron right now. We have a ton of it. Oh boy, we don't have a ton of this guy though. Knocked his head off. Oh, all right. We can't mine this yet because oh, we can. All right, because I'm serious quartz. Very nice. All right. I don't know how much of this we're going to need for our questing here, but maybe we will uh, need some in the moment. Anyways, because I do think this quest is going to end up being two parts. Tin ore, we need like 16 of this. Luckily, we can get it all now. The uh, data on this is still fine. The data on this is not fine. So now it's good. Skill level's master with this, though. And it's already plus eight attack. So actually, that's as high as it's going to go is four hearts only. So, unfortunate, unfortunate. Uh, lead we can get, I don't know if it's part of the questing or not, but we'll grab it all the same because it is useful for, for uh, some early machines, I believe. 
and various things. We'll grab all that. And there's some coal here too. So why not? Because why not? You know, we need coal. Alright, so I'm just going to mine around here a little bit, and uh, we're pretty safe down here now, so I think we won't have any more incidents. I'll just have to keep mining around, it's going to take a little time, so I will be back after we've collected everything we need for this next quest here. Alright, so we finally did find some gold here, it took a lot longer than I wanted it to, but we did find the four pieces we need. And oh, five, six? Oh man, we have one pocket here that had all of it in there, wow. How about that? Well, that's everything we need then. So we can turn that quest in. Hopefully there's not a second stage to that quest. I really hope there's not. This took forever. Oh man, I'm mining so much. This is this is like why 27 here, 25, something like that. Yeah, 25. Uh, I did die once, as you can see here. So that's it's a black mark against me, unfortunately. But uh, you know, it's 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 a little harrowing getting back too. I just realized there's no way to reset my spawn in this, as far as I know. Uh, I can't sleep in this dimension, I'm pretty sure. So every time we die, we end up back at the tower. So I think we'll definitely have to do something with the tower here soon so that it's a safe spot to get in and out of easily. Um, it is a safe spot in general too, which is nice, but um, I went the wrong way here, didn't I? Yes, I did. This is our normal path here. Okay. And then I made a little path up here to get back out. Oh boy. It's always confusing here. We got guy over there. There we go. All right. Now we're out. Now we're out. And we're back at the base just like that. Fantastic. All right, let's head into our cube here, and then we'll uh, turn in the quest and plan our next steps. So, moment of truth. Let's take a look at the quest here and see that we have everything completed here. Two quests for unclaimed rewards. Okay, what was what's the other one? Uh, we have. Oh, we need Certus Quartz. Oh, we almost have all that. Uh, not quite. We have four. Well. At least we got everything else we need. One diamond, one eight lapis, right, redstone. We just need Sardis Quartz. Okay, that's not terrible, but uh, it does one more thing we need to do for this. Uh, what is the quest that we can complete here? One cluster, don't clean room. Okay, that's right. We did do uh, making a compass because it's nice and easy, so we'll get a reward bag for that. Might as well to collect that one while we're here and see what's inside of it. It is a basic reward bag. Yeah, oh, that's actually not a bad thing. That actually help us complete the other quest here. Um, and we can actually, we might be able to complete that one in a moment here. So, let's go take a look at that. Entering darkness, we do need to get the seeds one here, which is, uh, potatoes, carrots, sugar canes, and wheat. We can almost get all of that, I'm pretty sure. Sugar cane's the only thing we're waiting on, I think, so that, actually we can't do anything with this. But firm cotton we can probably get now. We need to make a six wool. And then forge the darkness is the other one with unclaimed rewards, right? We made a, a made a bronze block, uh, earlier here. This will get us some bronze shears, which we're not gonna need right now. Let's just drop those off in here. And uh, also, we can probably make this Invar one. Then we found a, f a couple of a couple of things. We get Invar fishing rod. We do have some Invar. I think I made some up actually between episodes. Not between. I didn't make some while I was off camera here. So let's get that out of there and get that reward claimed as well. And then we can start making some armor, some better armor for ourselves. Some metallic protection makes us all bronze armor. And here we can probably do all Invar armor. I don't know which one's gonna be better for us. There's a lot of little tasks we need to complete in here. And then we have two. Do you believe you can quests? I don't understand. They want us to make two jetpacks? Okay. Um, I don't. I feel like these are going to complete at the exact same time. So I wonder if that's intentional or what there. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff we want to do. Maybe we'll do this next time. Is upgrade this now that we have some stuff that can actually mine up city. I think we can do it with this. Uh, redstone, not quite there yet. Um, we're going to have to make a new pick, I think, in order to level it up still. There's our Invar block, though. So we'll get our Invar fishing rod. Don't know how much we're going to be able to use that. Uh, we'll put that in the chest as well here. And now we have all these ores here, we just need some more Certus Quartz to finish that quest here. I think we'll hold off on that. Finding the Certus Quartz is going to take more time, more time than I want to spend on this right now. I do want to do more Unearthing the Darkness here, because there's another thing, the Icy Biome, which we can try to find. It is, uh, it is at 141, 54, 50, negative 59. Let's go, take, let's go outside here so we can take a look at the coordinates and let, we'll leave the Invar in here. We'll make some better armor uh, between episodes here, or maybe uh, next episode. So let's get out here and then we will... Uh, take a look at our quests here. We'll take a look, uh, first, we'll take a look at our quest book here. And it is at 141, 54, negative 59. So this is underground, I think. Uh, this is, I think, right, it said XYZ? XYZ. Oh, so Z is negative. Okay, so that this is why the 54 is the height and 59. Actually, the best thing we can do is just uh, to put a marker in. Um, so we'll go B and we'll go location is 141. It was at 54 was the height, and now I'm not going to remember what the middle one was here. Uh, I'll save that for now, we'll come back to it in a second here. It was 54 was the middle, and then negative 59, so 141, negative 59, okay. 
So Z is negative 59. And again, we'll call it IC. And see how far away it is here. At 54 is the right height. I think we'll make it blue, of course. Ice, ice blue, of course, because that's going to look good. And uh, let's save that. Where's our... We're missing one of our uh, our last marker for the village here. We didn't, didn't save on here for some reason. Um, but that's okay. So, let's take a look at the journey map here. And where is that marker? I see it's going to be over to the right there. There's where the... Uh, over here is where our uh, uh, village was, I think. This is where the tower is. And... Um, it's not loading for some reason. That's fine. We'll get there. It's far away, man. It's further away than the last one is. We took like eight, nine torches to get over the last time, and we don't have nearly that much this time around. Let's see if we have any more of the uh, the stuff we need to make more torches. Because I mean, that's that's crucial. We'll need torches here for this whole project. Or to see, um, we have eight luminite. That's only gonna make four torches for us. Well, it's better than nothing. Can we get there with four torches, you think? Again, I th well, five torches with the, with, the, with the one we had already. Unlit one here. Five torches to get to that far away. I don't know, it's gonna be close. Let's see, how, if, how far away is it? It is 153 blocks away. Can we get there with four torches without dying, without, with five torches without dying? Let's leave some valuable stuff here. I rearranged these chests here too, I don't know if I mentioned that. Um, let's leave the stuff we don't need right now. A head I died with. Uh, we'll even leave this here. So we don't. If we if we do die, we're not going to lose anything. Um, you know what? We do need to save the cube. Actually, I, I take that back. We do need to save this with us. We need to take this with us so we can make sure we get the required coordinates. We'll take this with us for defense. Uh, take a bow with us just so we have it in case more more defending is necessary. Uh, and we will take a pick with us just in case we need to mine anything. I think that will be good. I will take the shovel too because we might need to mine something else or we'll shovel something. Something might need some serious shoveling. So let's. Uh, all right. Where is it? Where is it? We just had. Okay, it's over that way. All right, so I think the best thing to do is to get out of here first. And we're going to go this way. And that might exit. Uh, actual exit's over this way, I think. And we'll go. We can make that jump. We can actually get out here nice and smoothly. Oh, we can almost make that jump. I'm not, I'm not going to fall down there again. No, 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 no. You stay away from me, you. There you go. All right, see you later, man. Uh, let's take these out. And we can get over here easily. Then we get back to our stairs. Our secret super sneaky way out here. And then we'll sneak out this way. And this the, the goal is over that way. So, um, here we go. Monsters in the distance. I can already see them piling up. We're just going to lay some torches down, though. Not going to be that far away, hopefully. It's underground, too, I think, possibly, though. Alright, we got two torches left. I'm going to wait. It's the last possible second. Oh, we're not going to make it, are we? All right, this is going to be bad. We're going to start taking damage. We're going to have to... Oh, look at this. It's ice over here. All right, we're in the darkness. We're going to take start taking damage in a moment here. I'm going to lay it down here. And now we're uh, in an icy biome with no hope of returning until we get down there and get that, what we're looking at. Okay. So, how deep is it? Oh, my gosh. Let's take a look here quick. We're going to start taking damage any second. Okay, we have to get down there. Oh, my God. Okay, we did not plan ahead here. So, we're going to have to do some mining here. All right. Okay, we're just gonna have to wait for a moment because we have to do some mining, get some more torches. Because I really don't think we'll be able to repel down there very easily. Um, so let's go back and get some more mining done. If I can find my path, holy cow! Where's the next? Uh, where's the next torch from where I left? I don't want to leave my little torch here. It's keeping us alive. Um, all right, I see where my death was. That's where we're going. That's where we're headed. All right, take care of this guy. I think there's only one of them over here. All right, let's run back quick and hit that torch on the way. Uh, oh, this is a node actually. Oh, got mistaken there. All right, so we lost, we lost our, uh, we lost our path. Oh god. But uh, we'll make it through the darkness here quickly. Okay, no death, no death. All right, great. Now we just gotta carefully get back into our base. Um, like this, I guess will work. Uh, yeah, okay, so I'll go mining here quick and get some more of this luminite that we'll need to uh, progress here because we need a lot more torches and there's torches everywhere here, but I can't break them because of the risk of uh, actually losing them. So we're gonna have to wait on that and then uh, I'll be right back after I get some more luminite for more torches here because man, we're gonna have to get deep here. All right, so we got 16 luminite dust. That's the equivalent of eight more torches, so that'll be pretty good for us. I also made up some bronze here in the smell three as I was off camera here a minute ago. So we got a new set of armor here. 
which will keep us more defended in the darkness. Uh, won't save us from the darkness, but it will defend us more against the enemies that lie and wait for us. And we'll make up more eight torches. That'll be plenty, I think, to get over there. We managed to get over there without any incident last time. So we just need to light those up. And our flint and steel can remain here, I think. Although we could use this as a mean of means of lighting something on fire to provide some light temporarily. Might not be a bad strategy. Um, it does take steel to make, though, I think. Yeah, we don't have any steel just yet, so maybe we don't want to waste that, because otherwise, if we can't make more steel, uh, we're going to be stuck as far as that goes. How do we make steel in this? Uh, let's see. We need an induction smelter to take pulverized coal and iron ingots. Makes sense. Otherwise, molten steel can make by combining liquefacted coal and molten iron. Liquefacted coal requires us to make coal, pulverized coal or coal powder first. So either way, we're gonna have to start making some. We can't just throw coal in there. We have to actually pulverize it down first. So we have to make a pulverizer here soon, which we're probably in the in the mood for. I think soon here to double our ores a little bit differently than this. Start creating power uh, for different means. Uh, that could be very very soon. I just don't want to get started in that just yet because I know there's gonna be quests related to that kind of stuff. I'm sure. So uh, maybe we'll hold off on that for now, just to, until we know what the quests are gonna be. Uh, that way we don't have to make some progress over again. The other thing I'm going to build right now is a rope ladder. Does it work like this? Or is it st sticks in the middle? Um, I think this will help us get down there faster. What is this? Fuse. Oh, we don't need that. We just need a rope ladder. We can only make eight of it. Yeah, that's not going to be nearly enough. That's not going to be nearly enough. Yeah, eight, eight rope ladder probably is going to help us a whole lot, unfortunately. Uh, we could use a little bit more if we had more string someplace, but I'm pretty much tapped out on string now. I used up all that bone meal we got in order to finish the couple quests here, though, so let's actually finish those in right now. We have uh, this one turned in. I decided that I would go looking for that Certus Quartz because we only needed uh, one, according to our thing here. I had 11 in here already, so I was like, ah, let's go find one quick. Uh, so we got that. We can turn it in for uh, 64 shiny ore plus 3 diamond ore, which can't actually mine yet. An emerald and some iron. Uh, we can also get 16 more torches, a full heart, or some reward bags. I think uh, we're down to 14 lives now. I mean, the heart might make a lot of sense, or eyes torches are also pretty valuable. Uh, let's go with the heart, because that's a little more permanent, I guess. Maybe not. Uh, we'll claim that reward, though. And we'll get that heart added to our group here, back to 15, then. And then uh, we'll throw these valuables in here, if I can find room for them. Let's take that out. Take that out. Those aren't valuables. And shiny ore needs to go in there too. Oh, we have a lot of it actually. 60, we have actually two already. Uh, that's good to know. A uh, block of iron can go in there. And we actually have the wool quest ready to turn in. So let's turn that one in too. For this, we'll get uh, firm cotton that gives us uh, either yellow carpet or black carpet. I guess we'll get yellow carpet. Um, quarter of a heart and a reward bag. Okay, let's get yellow carpet. It's a little bit different. Only 12 is not really going to be much much room to do anything with here. Uh, let's head back out because I know there's more storage space on the outside here. A lot more storage space. So we have all this space here. So let's drop these things off in here. Do we have any more string? We do. We can make at least another couple of ladders here. Um, so we'll do that. There's another 20. It's 24. That's like, that might be enough, actually. Right, so maybe we'll put those good use here. Uh, turn those into here. Reward bag is a basic one, unfortunately. Sound muffler. Well, that's not too useful. Don't really want that. Um, anything else we want to get rid of here? Oh, we got to turn. Did we turn that quest in. Yes. Anything new unlocked? No. Oh, here we go. Grinding it down. Okay, cool. So we can actually start doing this grindstone stuff here in this. We'll start making our machines. Okay, so we found the quest line for that now. Finally. All right, and then also, um, we have to do the seed one here, which we can almost do. This might be enough, actually. See if we have enough now. Or we're missing three still, so we need this sugar cane to grow up one more time. We'll get that soon. Uh, we'll turn that one in next time, I think. Other than that, I think that's all we can turn in for now. Yep, nothing else there. We're going to go to the icy thing here now. And we have eight torches. We can get there, I think. We'll leave our carpets here. We don't need to take those with us. We have our food. Leave our heart here. Uh, leave the coal here. Leave all that, st all that stuff here. Take the hammer with us, just in case we need it. Leave the hoe. And we're good. Okay, so now I think we're ready to head back out on our expedition here. Uh, we'll head back down the same way as we did before here. And so hopefully we can get down to the ice. Oh, I kind of mined this out, didn't I? This is a little more perilous than it used to be. I'll fix that up soon here. Make it a little more easy to get around here. Because this is a nice way in and out. Enemies can't really follow me too easily that way. 
Uh, same with this way. They can't really swim very well compared to us. All right, so I see a lot of enemies on the way here. We're just going to sprint, I think. Just keep moving. Uh, enjoy some light before we leave. And now we'll go. Okay, run. Run, run, run. Have a snack when we get there. Replenish all that uh, wasted uh, energy and health. Get on my waistline. Slow me down. Oh, this is the big one. Okay, I'm gonna put a thing right here so we refresh our things. This is this is a big path right here. All right, we need to, don't want to waste too many of these because I know there is a light right here. All right, so we've made it to the ice. Let's put another thing here. Let's see if we can see a nice way down here. Um, let's see if there's a good way down. Actually, right here would be a good spot for this. Drop this here. Can't put it on snow. Oh, we can't put it on snow. We have any we don't have any other blocks with us. Alright. Um, we might have to just dig this out then. Oh! No, 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 not like this. Not like this. Alright, let's uh let's let's get our shovel here and dig out these blocks here quick. Make a little uh we'll just go after him. I was gonna say we can make a little wall, defensive wall here, but we'll just go after him. Oh, we got a uh, indoor flying frame can get repair on it. That's actually really great. Oh, man. We're in an enemy problem. We should have brought the torch with us. And we just lost our torch. We lost the torch. All right. I think it's time to start getting down there. Um, let's dig it. Let's dig it down. Let's carefully. I don't know how we're going to get back out. Luckily, this has silk touch on it, though, so we could possibly get back out of here pretty easily. Uh, let's put the torch down here. Now we just pillar up here, maybe, at the end. Oh, we're so close. I should have brought a bucket of water with me. That would have been smart. There's some there's some actual blocks, okay. Put a torch here, and then we gotta see the last one for the bottom, I think, now. So let's take some of the actually let's try this, see if we can lay this down now. I still can't lay it down. We need a solid block. Uh let's grab this block here. Let's try this. Put this here, put this here. Oh, it works. Right, let's jump to it. Okay, not too bad, not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, we need a light down here quickly. Oh god, okay, we made it. We made it, there's a creeper over there. I'm gonna take care of him real quick. Alright, well, not so much, but... Uh, that was good enough to do the job here. So, we can get down in there and finally see what the icy one holds for us. And, ooh, very cool. Um, hi guys. Welcome, you guys have been busy in here, I see. Uh, we'll have to take a look and see if this is upgraded when we get back out of here and see if we can take it with us right away. Otherwise, we're gonna have to come back. But, uh, yeah, we can get a snowy uh, area going. It's very uneven, very uneven terrain. But we can just come in here and shovel up, get snowballs whenever we need them. Um... Yeah, pretty great. Not that we're going to run out of snow anytime soon here, because we have uh, plenty. But, uh, nice. I don't like the uneven terrain. We're going to have to do a, do a little bit of work in here to... This is a nice cooler, though. Maybe we can put our food in here or something like that uh, to keep it cold. Not that we need to do that, but we could do it. All right, so... Let's get back out of here. This is not upgraded. Well, shoot. Um, this is going to take us up to there. All right. And we'll pillar up the rest of the way, possibly. Let's just pillar up. There we go. It's risky if somebody shoots us, but I think this is the fastest way out of here. I don't know how we'll get back down again. We'll have to use uh, another rope ladder to get back down again. And really, if we grab one of these blocks here, and then put the rope ladder on that, we should be able to do it. Okay. Let's go like this. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. I hear him coming. I know it's, I know it's coming. I know it's up. What's up, what's up is this guy gonna knock me into the hole? That's what's up, that's what's up here. Alright, so let's put down, uh, one of these cobblestones here. Right here. We'll put the rope ladder on that. This is pretty far down, it actually gets us down to the other one, so that's perfect. That, that'll be our way in and out then. Alright, so I think we've made it. Now we just gotta see it safely back home. And I wish we'd have brought some of those diamonds with us. Actually, we can't even mine the diamonds yet, can we? Because they're in ore form. We don't, you don't have a, we don't have a pick that can actually mine diamond yet. So, we'll have to work on that, and then we can come back, bring some diamonds with us, and uh, grab that icy, icy block. And then, 
we have uh, more things unlocked here now. Let's take a look and see what under the darkness here. We should have this one now. All right, so Icy is completed. We need another compact machine. It looks on like another tiny one. Another full heart. So we'll take that right away. We might need it on the way home here. Um, and what else can we do here? Uh, let's see. Oh, another again. Okay, so we can go to Hell, which is 669 away. We, this is probably the place we probably have to go to get uh, to get more maybe quartz. I don't, I don't know. There's a quartz quest that was coming up here, I think. Um, looks like a bigger, we get a bigger thing out of that one too. And here we're going to get some nice big one here too. This is a nice machine actually. So here Desert 855. So now we're going for a little big, big trip next. So uh, we have to do more mining in the meantime here, I think. Uh, get more resources so we're ready to go. And then uh, that'll be next time. So let's actually, before we wrap up, let's head back home safely and make sure we get there. Okay. So now we saw which way we didn't want to go. We don't want to go that way. We want to go this way now. Uh, with the torches here, it won't be too big of an issue, I think. Barring anything unfortunate. We should be able to make it back home. Oh, big slime on the horizon. Uh, it's like a hurdles course here. All right, I think we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Uh, swimming now is the hard part. But this is a good defensive strategy, I think. There we go. All right, so we're in. Uh, we just gotta drop down over yonder. Perfect. All right, cool. We're in. Holy moly. Okay, we've made it back home. We're safe. Time to wrap it up for this episode. Thanks, guys, for watching another episode of Minecraft Obscurity. We'll be back with more adventures next time. Hope you're enjoying the series, and I'll see you guys next time for more. Have a good night.